Hey guys, we are very excited to present to you today the best reviewed skateboard on Amazon. What is it now? Yeah! This thing was shock and awe. I was so interested to see what this was and it made me think at some point in time I have skated this board before. Maybe we have even made a video with this board, but this is completely different. We have a brand new video concept idea for you today. So I have this board right here, which has the white fang wheels, metal trucks, but the trucks are metal, shocking, and the white fang board with the white fang grip tape, and I'm gonna be skating this, and then the braille, best beginner complete. We're putting these two decks head to head I'm gonna do 10 tricks which have been specifically chosen by Mr. Gabriel Horacio Iglesias Cruz and we're gonna rate how I feel on those tricks so I'm gonna rate it and then Gabe is gonna rate how those tricks look. And I'm a little bit nervous, I'm not gonna lie. My kidney stones are brewing in the back and I'm not sure if I can even do a kickflip. So how are you gonna choose these tricks, Gabriel? They're already here. They are not. You already, <laughs> okay. Well, first things first, straight out of the box, this one, has no plastic under the bolt. Why they can't just put the plastic over the bolts, I don't know, but that is a, that is a thing. My first impressions, I'm gonna also try, you know, obviously I am the owner of Braille skateboarding. I fully designed this board from every aspect of it, how it would look, how it feels, how the trucks work. I got this board down as cost effective as I could while still making the best skateboard I could for beginners, and this thing, I don't know who designed it. I don't know where it came from, or I don't know anything about it, but I can tell you, I'm gonna do my very best to give a very unbiased review. Like if this board is good, I'm, I'm willing to say it's good. So I guess I'm trying to let them know I'm gonna try and not be biased, but there is a chance that I might be a little biased. So right off the bat, I'm gonna tell you what I like about this board. The grip tape feels pretty good. It's decently it? coarse. Yeah, I think so. It's not as good as this grip tape, not even close. I would say this grip tape is twice as good as this, but I've felt some grip tapes in my day that were just horrendous, and this is not horrendous. And I thought this board was gonna have plastic trucks, and those trucks, my friend, are metal. A huge deal when you're getting a brand new skateboard is metal trucks. So the Braille Complete is going for $99. It's often on sale, There we do have sales, but this bad boy, I believe this bad boy is $40. How they're able to make a skateboard at all for $40 is beyond my comprehension of understanding, which can only mean, now that I've done all this skateboard manufacturing, it can only mean that they skimped on vital things that are very important to making a good board. I have a guess. Tell me. I think it's the wood. You think so? I think so. I think it's the wood and I think it's the bearings. The wood already feels much cheaper. I think the bearings are probably not very good. The urethane on the wheels is not great. So this has not cheap wood, but it has the cheaper glue. So this is not as strong as, you know, the board that I would always be skating. Those are like the absolute best skateboards that can be made, made by Mr. Paul Schmidt. So yes, this board has a water-based glue. What the manufacturer will tell you, and I found this to be true as well, is if you're skating anything bigger than a five stair, you will notice this will bend and flex more. So the epoxy-based glue is stronger, it's gonna hold that board together better, and it will make the board stronger. So if you're a beginner that's doing something bigger than a five stair, don't get the beginner complete, get the regular complete. Um, but for learning all of the basic skateboarding tricks like Skateboarding Made Simple Volume 1, this is your ticket. This one, well, we'll see, we can only test it. All right, Aaron, let's begin. This is trick number zero, this does not count. This is just to let you warm the legs up a little bit. Okay. Let's start with a kickflip. How is that not trick number On one? Flat. No. I thought we were going, I thought that was like trick number seven. No. Because we're going through like skateboarding made simple, Ollie, front side 180, back side 180, pop shove, front shove, heel flip, kick flip. No, no, we're going full park with oh, this. Oh, dang it. I'm gonna start with the white thing. I just stepped on it. It feels so bad. Just so bad. You know in the Walmart board when you push and you're in the bearings just go, mm -hmm. oh no. This thing gonna break. <laughs> this thing might not make it to the kickflip. Well, I mean, if it breaks, there's your answer. It's fully flexing just on that. Okay, okay, flip it up. See, that's what I was gonna say too. It's almost like how many tries does it take? You know what I mean? It's all part of the rating. That was a good kickflip, though. <laughs> Took me too, but I got a beast kickflip uh -huh. on that. Now for the Braille beginner complete. Braille beginner complete. 
first try, no setup. See, I step on this, and I think I'm on a board. Do you want to take that like one? like a skateboard. Do you want to take that one? Yeah. Oh, why, should I do two tries since I did two on that one? No, no, I'm just saying, I'm, I'm rating your style. Oh, you're right, my style? Yeah, how I the tricks are trick landing. zero, though. Okay, uh, yeah, I think my kick was on that one. Okay. Had a little more steez. That was actually a test. Hold up. Wow, come on. That was actually a test. I was trying to get you to lower your guard. That was trick number one. Okay. Give me my guard. My guard's up. All right, your guard's up now. All right, so now you get to go rate how each one felt, and I'll rate your style. So this is you right here. My feeling. It one to one ten. To ten. Ten being the best, one being the worst. Yeah. I'm gonna go eight. Eight for the bro complete. I mean, ah, it's so hard to say because here's the thing: like once I popped and when I was in the air, mm -hmm. well, I can't. You're not reading the board at all. You're completely in the air. That's true. The kickflip itself felt fine, but the riding of it. I had a really hard time not getting right in a one. Oh, okay. So I'm not gonna lie, I think your Amazon kickflip was better, which is why I asked you to redo the other one. I'm gonna give your Amazon kickflip a nine. I'm gonna give your Braille kickflip an eight. Oh, I feel but, that. But it's like, it's important though. All right. That so was a We're ten. gonna move on to trick number two now. Are you ready to I'm, go? I'm ready. All right, trick number two is a backside flip on the hip. Okay. I like that. Okay, last time I started with the white fang, so I think I should flip off every each and every one. All right. Oh, -ho! See, can I get I a? I knew he was rating my style, so I put a little extra. Oh, stank. get out of here! I'm about to I put a little extra. I'm about to take some points out for that. Stank on the end. That was yeah. good, that was boy. <laughs> That was interesting, because I thought I wasn't going to have enough speed to get up to the ramp at all, uh -huh. and I had too much speed. All right. Slayed it. How did each one feel? I, I feel like just from watching you skate that board, the white fang, I know how you feel. And I'm gonna give it a really hard time not giving it a one. I mean, if it's a one, give it a one. I feel like people are gonna be like, you're just trying to make your board look better. I'm, I'm, I'm Leave it filming in the comments this, and I see you, and you look like you're not enjoying yourself very much. I enjoy myself on every skateboard ever made, <laughs> too. <laughs> And the braille complete, I'm gonna go seven on that one. I had a little bit of foot off there, but man, that stank leg at the end, ooh, I don't know. Yeah, I'll go with seven. I'll leave it at a seven. And for your Amazon backside flip, I'm gonna give you a solid three. Nice, it looking was, uh, good. The flip was decent, but it didn't rotate, and then you did like the extra, <laughs> the revert to save it, and it just didn't look good at all. Uh, the man. braille one, I'm gonna give you. harsh. I'm gonna give you, man, I'm gonna give you a seven for that one because that stank leg just really took me out of it, man. If you just rolled away, I would have been maybe eight, nine, but really? the stank leg just really? completely took me out of it. See, you don't want the after No, man, I want the steez in the trick. I want the trick to do the talking, okay. not the after steez. Okay, give me the next trick and I might have to take this off because, you know, this is this is my steez for the day. Okay. When I have this underneath, you know, dang, Aaron tried hard today. Mm -hmm. He picked out two shirts <laughs> and put them both on. All right, the next trick I want is a nose manual across the box over there. Bro. Well, white fang goes first on this guy. Here we go. Which side do you think the nose is? Maybe that was the part I of the think problem. Ooh, no, 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 it's, it's the other way. Twin tail. G, in, G on the nose. First try. Oh, I'm, I'm very surprised you landed that. Maybe that one was too easy. Maybe I, I was too friendly on that one. My back foot slid off when I came off of the nose manny and I almost missed it. But oh, that's not good. Oh. So on one, your foot almost fell off and on the other one, you got to pop out higher than a skateboard. Let's get that rating. Okay, this one just feels, it actually just feels like my board. And this one feels scary. Two? But I'm, I've knocked it up to a four though. That's good. Four on the Amazon, cause, okay, I, I expected it to roll less well. It did roll pretty decent. And I expected to be able to pop out and I my foot completely slid off, which is the grip tape. I mean, I guess you could say user error too, but this one didn't slide off and it did the same. And for my rating, for your Braille complete, I'm gonna give you an eight, good pop out, 
for Amazon. I'm gonna give you a seven, because it was still really good. Yeah. Just, if you popped out, I would've given you that final point to tie it, but I don't think either one was better than the other, really. Yeah, high scores. Okay, trick number four, I feel is getting intense. We're taking this off. All right, Aaron. What do you got? Trick number four, we're moving to the A-frame, and I wanna see a tray flip. Straight into the tray. Straight into the tray. Okay, braille board's going first. Tray flip. You know what also is like in my head, living rent free right now, is because you know when you do a trick and then you do a trick and you think to yourself, I'm gonna make this look good with the style. It's, it's really hard. You kind of doom yourself from the beginning when you do that. <laughs> yeah, you do. First try, eh? So that was the Braille beginner complete. <laughs> there wasn't enough speed to make it over it. That's what I told you about the bearing. Okay, run it back. all day dad yeah. honestly it's pretty wild that this is happening right now dan because he's been pretty close in terms of tries landing with both boards but this is the first time it's been very clear it's the pressure White Fang got free real estate. That's it, right here. Done. I can't. Woo. Okay, so the Braille complete obviously had more speed. It popped nicely. Felt good. I was surprised to land it first try. I'm going nine. The Amazon board, I don't know how many tries it took, maybe 53. Um, but you know when you try 53 times and then you finally land it, that's also like a nice feeling of accomplishment. So for that feeling, because it was so hard to land, I'm giving it a two. Otherwise it would have been zero. And Dan, over here. I'm sweating, Dan. For the Braille beginner complete, what rating do you give his first tray flip? You want me to, you want me to rate it with the Sharpie? Yeah. The first one, I give eight. And then the second one, I give six. Okay. What made you think six and what made you think eight? Deep because down. the way that it flips. Let's get a little mini ramp. You want a little here. vert? Yeah. I vert think... action? Hey, you said it, not me. Your vertical vampire? So, what trick do you want? I was thinking maybe kick flip rock fakie. Oh my god, I knew you were going to say that. So, we're going to do a kick flip rock fakie on this. That's scary. Baby, don't feel the beeper. I want a Jamba Juice for first try on this. Mm -hmm. Man, I can't even tail spell. I know you wanted that I so bad. I wanted it. I wanted to roll in just like that. And now you have to do it again. Dang it. Derek, come on, give me some love. Right here for Debo. Drop in master. Hi. How's the white fang? Feeling great? Okay, now let's see how this guy goes. I'm almost worried this is gonna pop a little bit too much. You need to. Whoa! That was a factor right there, Cruz. You know when you get the brand new wheels and they still have the ridges in them? Mm -hmm. Slip and slide right out. Whoa now, whoa now, whoa now, whoa now! Hey! Sorry, just wanted a little session there. Okay, white fang, a little rough, a little scary, but I feel like I popped and caught the flip pretty good each try. So for that, I'm giving it a three. And the braille board, I felt like I was a little bit off to the back, like a little heavy on the heels. But because of that, I'm, I'm gonna give this one a six. 
Didn't feel as good as I'd liked it to have felt. I'm judging you I harsh. slayed that. Make sure you're taking into account the fact that it was in a line, boy. I landed it so good, I, I did a tray flip rock afterwards. To fakey first try. Six! Get out of here with that. You think they look the same? Let me explain why. Let's get an instant replay right now and see if those Let two tricks look the why. same. If the instant replay in my mind does not betray me. Yeah. You did flick the white fang board better, yeah. but you landed so deep in the rock and you kind of lost control and were a little wobbly on there yeah. and then had to get in. That's why I took the point out. The braille complete, right? The flick was atrocious. The really? The flick was like fully like Elon Musk SpaceX to the moon rocket, my really? guy. The stall was much better, so by that they even out. So yeah. I just gave them six and six. And in a line, tray flip rock. No, I am no. rating the kickflip rock, not the line. All right, Aaron. Hey, what's up? Trick number six. On to trick number six, I will award you with a small break. Heel flip on flat. Oh, I told you not to do that now. You think it's going to break? Yeah. A uh, heel flip. Okay. You just kickflip rock fakie. I thought heel flip might be the end of the game. You scared? The thing. Yeah. You scared? Yeah. Stop stomping like you're going down El Toro, I bro. I can only heel flip one direction, and that's El Toro direction. Well, wow. we just have it there. I just can't heel flip. You're forgetting your heel flip fundamentals here, man. I know, true. I gotta remember all the aspects. Why? What are you doing, mate? What are you doing? Heel flip, right here, for Derek. All right, wow. mate, all right. We got you heel flip, mate. Right here, first try. Wow, those are bad. Why heel are you leaning so far forward? Keep your weight over your board. Skate support? Yeah. Dang, boy. A little low, but. What? That was sick. <laughs> First try! Rate it up! Okay, I thought it was gonna break. It didn't break. You know what, Cruz? Man, the heel flip. I mean, I did land it first try on the white fang. You did. But this is why it's tough, because you know, I had all the practice working out my body direction on the first one, but you know what I'm doing? I'm giving the Amazon a six. I'm giving Braille board a six. Steady tie on the heel flip, because it took me so many more tries, but I think the heel flip, well, I'm, a, I'm interested to see what you say, but I think my heel flip was better on Braille, but it took me more tries. All right, my score is the Braille complete. I'm gonna give you a seven for your heel flip. Why? It was just a little wonky. And it's then the weird. Amazon one? And the Amazon one, like, so the Braille one, you, you leveled out pretty well. Yeah. It was like a solid heel flip. I just think you, you could have popped a little higher. Yeah. Maybe caught it a little nicer yeah. if I were to give you a 10, right? Okay. So I'll give you a seven for that. But the Amazon one uh, was like really quick, flick yeah caught it really soon yeah kind of rock it but still still a decent heel flip by your terms so i give you a six and i thought the amazon board was breaking Who's it? so i i really upped the score for amazon because it didn't break all right right now yeah. all right so we've done a little bit of hip a little bit of flat a little bit of transition yeah we're gonna go on to some stairs and rails now okay trick number seven on the flat bar front side 50 50. <sighs> Because you've tested out, you know, like everything on flat, like how it rolls, but now you gotta get the trucks on the metal and see how the trucks are, right? Because that's part of a complete, is how the trucks are. And if there's a beginner out there doing front side 50-50s, upgrade your gear. I mean, it is a, it is a, it is a beginner trick. Not on a rail, it's not a beginner <laughs> trick. I've been skating 30 years, I just learned it. If they were plastic, I'd be worried for you, but- Front metal, lip it, you're sure? No. No, that's gonna break. I need to see some metal on metal. You're good I'm at this trick that now. Side, but that was definitely a one. Just full send. Believe in yourself. You got me, right? You got me. Dude, they are not grinding at all. Do you wanna do you wanna I mean call it feels like it will grind? Why? Why? Every time you get into it good, it fully just sticks. Yeah, I don't know why, because they put the trucks in there. Uh, maybe it's the wheels rubbing against it. Got it.
Oh my god, Aaron. <laughs> oh my god. Are you all right? Dude. I'm not giving up. Dude. I gotta land this. Yeah. Now we have my pride on the line. Yeah, I know. First try! This is easy. Amazon won. I nearly lost my entire life. Bro, complete. Nine. Big difference. Big difference. I literally couldn't even describe it. The trucks are metal. Why don't they grind? I have no idea. For your Amazon 50-50, I'm not mad at it. I understand. I'm not mad at it. No, I'm, it, wasn't, it wasn't bad. I'm gonna give it a seven. 78 tries, but you know, once you got it, you got it. And the Braille one. Dude, I'm, I'm just gonna, I'm, I'm gonna give it a seven. Hit me deep. They were both, they were both roughly the same quality. <laughs> <laughs> I guess there's a big difference between how you're looking and how you're feeling. All right, here we go. Number eight. Give me just a regular backside board slide down the handrail. Down? Down, down that one. Down that oh. one. The, the, the three rail, not, not the handrail. Easy. I gotta be careful at this. I get body. It does feel like it's got quite a bit of wax on there. Just get one shot. Kamehameha. So sketchy. Oh! Feels like I almost ended my life. I'm, the, I'm going nine and a three. I'm gonna up the score because I landed it first try. But okay. the feeling, whew, I'm not, that was really scary. But on the braille one, I knew I have a board under my feet. It wasn't scary. Let's see what Gabe thinks about how, the, how it's looking though. Your braille complete board slide. No, award the first ten today. Steezy, wasn't it? Come Perfect on. Board slide. Amazon, I'm gonna give an eight. Okay, that's pretty good. It was, it was good. My golden ticket. Can't winning. complain about it at all. What I think more is that it just, it looked like you were really struggling to get it off the rail at the end, and you kind of had to force it off. And, and to that's get why it into the rail. Yeah, that's true, and that's why I didn't like it as much. But right. still, eight. Two tricks left. Next one going white fang going first. All right, yeah. yeah, let's go to the five. The five, not the three. Let's go to the five. I want a nolly. I cannot. No? There's oh, no. no way. Front one. Front one. I mean, I could try. I could try a front one. I think the five stars an ollie in the three box. Front one eighty. I think front, front one's doable if you send it. Don't fear the reaper. Can I get a practice ollie? Yeah. Okay, not bad. All right, you got the front one. You think? Yeah. I mean, I am kind of a daredevil. I do do all my own stuff. You are, stuff. man. Oh! We're gonna count that. In a line, even. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> I basically did a front side 360 into that quarter pipe. Damn! Whoa! That's a front one right there. Gunter. Gunter! Jeez! Okay, again, it, just goes, it almost goes into my head as like a fear factor of like, oh, I feel safer on this board because I know I have a board under me. Uh, I'm probably gonna go the same. We're gonna do a nine, we're gonna do a three. So I think once you get into that level of like, if this thing breaks under my feet, I'm slamming hard. Yeah. And I thought, I actually thought it was breaking on the ollie, to be honest. So I gotta give the board extra points because it didn't break on the ollie, let's say that. Okay, how did it look, Cruz? That front one on the braille board was a perfect 10 out of 10. True. Proper, good pop, tweaked it out, landed, full rotation, good. Amazon, I'm gonna give you a solid three. You thought I was gonna die. I didn't think you were gonna die, no. I just thought you were gonna land it better. And it was pretty <laughs> gnarly, but you had to do tic tacs to keep it rolling away, like, it yeah. wasn't, wasn't ideal. But leave it in the comments below, I did keep it rolling away, and that's something to that. All right, and the final trick, trick number 10, is a simple ollie down the three block. Starting with the braille beginner complete. Dang it. I don't, I don't know if this is possible. Oh my god. You just front one the five. On this, it's possible. It's easy. Although these trucks, the other thing about this video is I didn't adjust anything. Straight out of the box. Just, it is what it is. So the trucks are really, trucks are really loose. The one thing I'm concerned about is hitting wheel bite. You got it. Okay. A little wobbly on the rollaway, it's all good. I don't know if I can do this. Yeah, why? You're scared. Terrified. You're scared. Yeah, 100% You're scared. scared. But I guarantee this board's not breaking. If this board breaks, I'll, I'll owe you another Jamba Juice. Because you know what I think is going to break the tail? And then I'm doing the splits. And I really can't do the splits today. Oh, boy. 
All right, Gabe. You got we it. just got to run this. That's right. I told you. I told you. I did the splits exactly like I said. Oh my God. I told you. Bro, his <laughs> no, dude, he told me that was going to happen. I didn't believe it. Oh, dude, you all eat the five so good. Still, I knew. I five. told you. It's <laughs> oh, my knee went straight to the floor. Dude, I'm so sorry. Dude, the five Ollie just looks so solid. Dude, dude. He hit the knee to the cement. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be okay too. Otherwise, I probably wouldn't have commit so hard. Yeah. I thought I was straight bolts. Yeah. Where was my foot? Was I it on know. the tail? No, it was a good ollie though. It was about to be better than your regular one <laughs> on the railboard. All right. Well, because I did, I should probably go to, go to the hospital. I'm giving Amazon a zero, and I'm giving this one a ten because it felt solid. Railboard would give a solid eight for the ollie. Amazon. I'm gonna give a one because it bodied you. I mean, there couldn't be a better, like, just purely objective. I couldn't even make that up. You know what I mean? No. Gabriel will now average out the scores. We got a total wang danger of an 8.1 average on the Braille complete for Aaron's ratings. I should have put knee pads on. 8.1 versus a 2.6. Check that out here. We got the Braille complete versus the Amazon. This is Aaron's ratings on the feeling of it. And Gabriel Horacio Iglesias Cruz gave me a 7.9. Danny Darkslide. And we got a 5.6 on that. Yeah. Bad mamma jamma right there. I mean, an eight's not, not bad, right? Yeah, eight's good. I mean, you gotta understand, this is a board specifically made for beginners. Mm -hmm. This is not a professional, the highest, most top-notch quality, which just adds price. It's interesting because after dealing with all of the different like things, I mean, I've had a skateboard of many different price points. The cheapest one we ever made, which was still way, way, way better than this, was the one that was the Braille board that did go into sale at Walmart and I can tell you guys that that board the cost of that board at its cost not even including shipping is around $33 so I don't know how they would get this well I do know how it's just by degrading the materials but I don't know maybe that they, they got this cost to maybe like 20 and then they're selling it for 40 but you add shipping in there it's a whole different story kind of interesting interesting to learn all of those back-end pieces of it um, that board is more expensive and then the most expensive one I mean just the deck of the most expensive boards that we have to just have the wood not the grip tape or anything else is $16 so you're looking at a cost I mean just the cost of the materials is more than $40 see another good way that you can test the quality of the board is you just listen to it If you hear more of a snappy sound, you obviously know that the quality of that wood is better. So yeah, I designed this board and I didn't intend to make this just a commercial for the Braille Best Beginner Complete because I know some of you are probably thinking that. But yeah, I did design this board to be the actual best board for beginners. I think that you have to have a solid piece of wood under your feet, especially when you're learning the basic tricks. You have to have something that feels good enough that the materials itself is not gonna hold you back from learning that trick. So there you go, bada boom, bada bing. If you you're watching this video and you have not yet started to learn how to ride a skateboard, get out there and go learn to ride a skateboard. We have everything you need at BrailleSkateboarding.com.